What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into tea room. Royalty pulls up on CJ and Kamari for saying she got hit in the head. I don't know. Queen, Queen Ken trolling the air. Let's get it. <clears throat> so I'm pretty sure most of you guys are aware of this whole situation going on right now between Deer and Quee. Now, Quee and Ken went live to discuss Deer's shirt that she was wearing that stated, stop copying me. You're not even doing it right. As well as the whole situation with her allegedly copying Deer's style by buying the same knife set that Deer posted. Now, Quee and Ken were very upset. They even stated that Deer actually approved approached them in those townhomes when they were outside, allegedly. So Queen and Ken have had enough. Now they're beginning to troll Deira. Now three days ago, Deira posted a video of her moving out of that townhome. Now just as of yesterday, Queen and Ken posted a video that they moved out of the townhouse as well. This isn't trolling. They just being more open with the copying now. <laughs> I wish y'all would have just been like this from the beginning. They be asked me, but you know, whatever. <laughs> and as if you can see, the thumbnails look very similar. So in my opinion, this was their way of trolling and throwing a few shots, posting the exact thumbnail but you guys leave your opinions down in the comment section below but let's move on to this next topic ken is a beta with royalty and cj so cool now this whole situation is just crazy let me start off with what cj posted on snapchat the other day alleging that royalty got hit in the head apparently there's slob on my shirt that's for my dog uh yeah apparently the twins mom got punched in the head or something and people are asking me am i okay or did i have anything to do with it no but i did just pick my daughter up from school in a lamb truck and uh yeah we're gonna go to the grocery store because today is the day i get the kids so if indeed their mom did get beat up or punched or whatever hey that's not funny uh hopefully the kids are okay and they weren't involved or around to see that because that's just not how we live we're not trying to live like that no more so uh hopefully she can get it together because even though she thinks that I'm her biggest enemy. I, don't, I wouldn't wish her getting beat on because we too grown, man. If we're not getting paid to box, there's no need of letting your face be a punching bag. So let me explain what went on here. That nigga's so fucking disrespectful. <laughs> Royalty posted a video on Instagram with the caption that read, what are you going to do when you run out of lies? Eight and zero. Now, Royalty was getting drug tests because I'm guessing someone sent CPS back to her house. That's why she put eight and zero because they've been there eight times and each time she passed the drug test. That's ridiculous. Now, I'm guessing someone sent this to CJ and stated that Royalty got punched in the head. And that's why CJ went onto Snapchat and stated that Royalty got hit in the head. <clears throat> well, BSC TV dropped a video yesterday of royalty actually meeting up with cj at the twins drop off and she went completely off on him this mm -hmm. is what she had to say why would you say that broke ass ugly black ass is crazy you're a loser. You're a loser. Stop talking about me, bitch, because I don't like you. There you are. You just made the video say I got beat up. Who got beat up? Dude. There you go, lying again. You're nothing but a pathological liar. Learn to mind your business. Stop talking about me. Four twins. Who the hell want to deal with this every time I get dropped off? Hello. Is nobody so, thinking about the twins? Nobody want to laugh, too. What's funny? No, you're funny. You're funny. Look, you Stop talking about me. Stop talking about me. You're broken. You're ugly. Stop talking about me. 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 Stop talking about me
lying on her. She even called out Kamari for laughing. So if indeed their mom did get beat up or punched or whatever, <laughs> hey, that's not funny. And I'm guessing Kamari was there at the drop off. And that's why royalty stated that because CJ did mention in his previous video that he was bringing Kamari for protection. Now, you guys leave your opinions on all this down in the comment section below. Now, this is what CJ... They're going to get somebody into some shit, like some real shit, especially them kids. Because, you know, at some point, these kids won't be kids anymore, and they're going to be grown. And as long as this been going on, this is ancient, okay? <laughs> like, I done left YouTube, came back, came, left again, came back to YouTube to tell YouTube. And this shit is sad, bro. CJ posted on Snapchat after royalty approached him at the twins drop off hey man i got the video bro y'all want to see the video man i swear it was like bah! just straight knocked the freak out it was dirty man was royalty need to get on um snapchat so she can make her bag too dirty, but um yeah, if y'all want I the video man, on I to do, man 20 number snapchat yes sir i will be posting that video today but you gotta wait and see it. So now Ty Taylor from he the lying. Taylor Girls has responded to yet another OMG Girls versus Taylor Girls discussion. Someone on Twitter writes, who was better, OMG Girls or Taylor Girls? I'm trying to see something. Ty responds with, I thought we already settled this, Taylor Girls. Now then the Shade Room teens posted this interaction and they put a poll up. OMG girls or Taylor girls? And it appears that the Taylor girls were losing the battle. Then Ty and Daisha both went in the comments. Ty stated, LMFAO, they should drop a song in 2024 and we'll drop a song. Let's see who still got it. I think that's then fair. Daisha states, compare us to somebody that did over 15 million views. Well, I'm not going to lie. I don't know one OMG girl song. Um, and the Taylor girls have at least three songs that I still listen to today. So. And you guys know Regine was a part of the original OMG girls and she responded in the comment section with laughing emojis. Now, I'm not sure why they're even being compared because the OMG girls are more like an RB singing group and the Taylor girls yeah, this don't are make rappers. Sense so how are all. they even in the same category? Either way, Regine thought Ty's response was very funny. But you guys leave your opinions down below. You got OMG girls or the Taylor girls? Everybody's starting beef at this point. How you been? I've been good. How you been? The Foodie Chronicles. I'm just out here, y'all. Are y'all ready for season two of Toy and Regina? Because here, it's a lot of stuff coming up. Mm, she got a new man. Why won't this work? She got a new man, which means that new man might be on that show, which means that's a bag. Die. Super excited. Um, that shit crazy. Yeah. Just stay tuned. Like, life don't be hitting no more. That's like probably that. why they was filming Aspen. Well, not filming, but. You know, it was taking pictures and all that. Used to back in the day. That's why I don't get on here. Y'all don't really be hitting for real life. What y'all be talking about? Y'all be talking about that. Then they, then y'all. What y'all up to? Nah. Glad you're back on live, Mr. Girly. Yeah, I'm about to get off Girly. Because y'all ain't talking about nothing. I it's swear, I hate here. Instagram live. Hate it. Boy! <laughs> I love a buzz down middle part. I'm trying to tell you. Thank you. Yes, because she used to stay on here. I did. I used to stay on here. I used to stay on here, but I'm really about to go, y'all, because I'm pulling up to where I'm supposed to be going. And I ain't trying to have y'all know where I'm going. you will be pulling up to me. Like, where you at, Nate? Where you at? And I'll be like, oh, wow. Uh, oh wow Don't find me Yes you did Yeah I used to have talent shows on here I used to be turned But A lot of angry people Yeah it is too much more wrong. It is a lot of angry people I want to pray 
for everybody who's, you know, not having a good day. Hope you guys, they get better, you know. Hope you get that call. Hope you get that text. Hope you get that job. Hope you get that kiss you've been waiting I knew it was about to cut off. Not the kiss you've been waiting on. Girl, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Um, I'm done with this video. It wasn't too much to talk about. <laughs> the, I, look, I'll be trying my best to get y'all everything that I can give y'all <clears throat> for these videos, okay? I'm going to continue to do so. Just let me know what y'all thinking. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.